God because God is a good God. Yes, he is. He's better to us than we get your own self. We thank God for another opportunity just to stand before you. Yes. But most of all, we thank God for being saved. Yes, we thank God for the precious gift of the Holy Ghost. Yes. Thank God for his keeping power. Yes. Thank God he's a way out of the way. Yes. We love God down in our soul today. Yes. Do your soul, Lord Jesus. Yes. My soul loves Jesus. Yes. Bless his name. Amen. Hallelujah. We thank God today. Moving right on today. Man, God is so wonderful. And the Lord, he is so good. Yes, he is. I thank God today because God is in control. Yes, yes, he, is. yes he is. And God leads us and guides us in the way that yes. we should go. That's right. Amen. And we can prepare. We can do things. But God is in control. Yes, he is. Amen. That was something significant today as God was leading me to read a certain particular scripture that I have studied. Amen. And then I decided to get away from it. But Sister Lily began to sing the song, Strip me down, Lord, uh -huh. and make me over All right, now. again. Yes, and I want to talk from that thought today, Lord, yes, make good. me over again. Make me over, Lord. Hallelujah. Uh -huh. Sometimes we need to go back and do it over again. Yes, uh, I mean, Amen. sometimes one touch is going to do. Uh -huh. Sometimes we got to go back That's uh -huh. and get it right. That's right. That was a man who was blind, who Jesus spit in the mud. Yes, and in the clay and wiped it on his eyes and told him I want you to go wash in the pool of Salon yeah. uh -huh. and when he went and washed he come back seeing yeah. but guess what he was seeing the wrong thing right. he said how do you see me and ass yeah. mm -hmm. he said I see me and his trees yeah. mm -hmm. in essence what he was saying I see me in a high place uh -huh. I see me lifted up above the clouds uh -huh. I see me in his great statues yeah. Jesus said you're looking wrong all right. All right. You need to go back and wash. Yes, and when he went back and washed, he came back seeing yes, men as men. Amen. Hallelujah. How many know you can't put no more yeah, into that's right. it? That's right. Hallelujah. Ain't nobody no greater than God. That's right. It's, that's it's right. not, uh, you know, indictment. It's nothing wrong for you to come that's back right. and get it right. That's right. That's right. Sometimes you just don't do it. That's right. You got to go back Amen. and get it right. That's right. And the song says, strip me down, me down. Lord. Lord. Me me and Jesus. make me over again. Amen. When you say what? Strip me. Amen. Uh, take away everything okay, that's not like you. Okay. Right. Hallelujah. Amen. Take away everything. Amen. I have, uh, I've gained some things. I've added some stuff that wasn't there. You know what I mean? Right. Right. My attitude is not like it used to be. Right. Right. I get mad too quick. Now right. things upset me and bother me too much now. Amen. Lord, I need to be what made over. Amen. When Amen. David coming to the knowledge that hey, I have done something wrong, he said, creating me uh -huh. a clean heart yes. and renew, I renew, me right. make new. Amen. Hallelujah. Me makes over, me makes new. Yes, renewing me what? A clean heart. All right. Spirit, right. yeah. because who I see now, I have seen in a while. Right. Right. Hallelujah! How I many know when the old you comes up? Uh -oh. uh, right. When you got the old way and you, and you start acting like you used right. to act, you need to say, "What Lord, kill me again?" Yeah. Right. Paul said, "What modify the flesh?" Right. But then he said, "Renew me a right spirit, Amen. and take not the Holy Spirit away from me." How I many know we don't want to lose our joy right. when you become comfortable standing home? When you do something wrong, don't repent, then you know that you are you didn't back sleep. Hallelujah. Israel was in a messed up and a mixed up place. Hallelujah. And God will have to tell you something this morning because I had prepared it. But God it was so awesome that we had in our text today a weeping prophet by the name of Jeremiah. Jeremiah said, I'm, I'm just tired of Brother Lee. I'm just tired of them. I've been preaching to them and still they won't do what God said to them. Have you ever just preached to folks? Have you ever just done what all you can do is seem like it just got worse? But how many of God is able to rectify? Yes, he is. How many of God, everything is not the death penalty. How many of God is able to resurrect? Yes, he is. Yes, he is. From the book of Jeremiah, the, the 18th chapter. Amen. Familiar to the song and new to others. Right. And also I want you to look at another particular part of the scripture. I'm going to lead you there in a minute here. But the 18th chapter of the book of Jeremiah. Yes, sir. Then look at Lamentations, the third chapter. Amen. And we're going to go to Jeremiah first. But Lord, lead me over. I, I said, you know what? I've gotten away. You know, sometimes when you get up, you want to say something that you're comfortable with. Uh -oh. But sometimes God leads us on the way. Right. Right. Hallelujah. Because why? That we need to be what? Stripped over. Oh, that's right. We used to do 
you something having wood floors as a young boy growing up in the old days? Yep, right. Hallelujah. Every once in a while we got where we had spring cleaning. Right. And everything gum and everything that was on the floor had cake there. We had to open the house up, open the windows That's up, right. and let God air blow in. Then you had to get the water hose down and wash it in there. And then you had to get soap in the water and you had to scrape. And you had to, you know what I mean, sometimes you got splitters in your hands. But you had to clean the house. And they called it what? Spring cleaning. Something you had to throw away that was old that you didn't use. I'm going somewhere. I'm going to find some in here. You know what? It was old stuff, Sam, that you didn't even know you had in the cabinet. Potatoes and rotten and smelling. You had to what? Throw it away. You had to clean up. Say, I'm going to start what? Fresh. The old stuff need to be what? Sometimes it's thrown away. All right. And need to start fresh. Jeremiah said, I'm really, God, I, I'm tired. I've cried and I, I shed many tears. I cried over Israel, the deplorable state that they're in. Right. And seemed like they are not getting any better. How many know sometimes you cried over your children and seem like instead of getting better, they get worse? Right. Sometimes you, uh -huh. as a child of God, you know, you think, well, you know what? I'm making stride. Right. But seem like soon you put your foot down. Seem like you okay. get knocked back. Yeah, right. Come on, find some help. Right. 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 But he says, what? Well, make me over. Make me over. We're looking at everybody but who's. I say, yeah, find some help. Right. All right. Every sometimes, brother, we look at everybody else. Mm -hmm. But who's really a great is myself. Amen. Nobody held a gun to your head and made you do what you did. Right. But how many of you need to go back to the altar? Amen. Get down on your knees Amen. and stay there okay. till you get the Holy Ghost power. That's it. Uh, I dare you to tell somebody said we need some power. We need some power. But think about it is we need to be what? Made over. Amen. How many of God got the capability to make it over? Amen. Brother Hawkins sung a song years ago with his wife Tremaine. He said, no, the potter is able to put you back together yeah, again. Yes, in yes. case your situation has been turned yes, upside down. Oh, yes. uh -huh. And all that you have uh -huh. accomplished is now, now on the ground. You don't have to stay right. in the shape that you're in. Thank because the potter wants to put you back together, together again. Together again. Amen. You know what? You know a whole lot of us was just like Humpty Dumpty. Mm -hmm. Humpty Dumpty. Sit on the wall. <laughs> Humpty Dumpty had a great, a great fall. fall. A great fall. Right. And all the king horses no, no. and all the king men couldn't put Humpty Dumpty right. together right. again. Amen. But I don't know what King Humpty right. was right. talking about. Right. But the king that we serve yes, is able to pull back every piece yes, that was broken up. Amen. Jeremiah says, Oh, if my head was water. And my eyes are fountain of tears. I was weak both day and night. Mm. He said in the earlier verse, the harvest is past. Mm. The summer is in it. And still you're not saved. I cried. I told you. I shared. And you're still not saved. He said, now, wait a minute. I ain't going to preach no more. I'm tired, Brother Leafield. I'm not preaching yeah. no more. It ain't doing no good, God. All right. Hallelujah. He said, what throw me down in the, in the dungeon? Uh -huh. When they put him in the dungeon, he said, I'm in preaching. I'm not just going to do it no more. Right. He said, but right. when I think of the goodness Lord. of Jesus. Uh -huh. Y'all ain't going to help me. All right, I'm going to preach by my own sense yeah, today. Right, yeah. I don't even need no help today. Right, when I think about the goodness of Jesus. Yeah, yeah. And I realize it's just like fire. Yes, shut up in my heart. Yes, I can't hold my peace. Right. How many know if I shut up the rocks are fire? Yes, sir. And I don't want no rocks crying no, out. Not, not, not in my place. Yes, Amen. But he heard, he says, the 18th chapter, and verse 1 said, The word, I like that. The word. The word which came to Jeremiah from the Lord saying, Arise. The word arise means what? Get up. How many of sometimes you got to just get up? And it, it, look at the verb. He said, arise. Means get up. Oh my God. We should get up. I will to do nothing. Get up if you want it to be better. And the teacher told me this morning, what do you want to do? You want to be powerful? Or do you want to be